Hello, I'm Orbex, and we're here today with Val from Wyndham Forensic Group. Can you tell me a little bit about your company? Absolutely. Uh, Wyndham Forensic Group, uh, we have two, two lines to our business. We have a fully accredited forensic biology and DNA testing lab right here in Guelph. And we also do consulting to help build forensic capacity at the international standard throughout the world. Innovation is clearly a big part of what you're doing with forensics. Can you speak to that at all? Yeah, so we, uh, in Canada, a lot of the forensic testing is done by the government labs. Uh, but we've developed a number of products and services uh, that are a bit innovative that uh, aren't offered elsewhere. Uh, one, of our, one of the things we're proud of is that we're able to do testing for sexual assault victims uh, directly for them. Uh, they still have the option to, uh, to participate in the criminal justice system if they want, but uh, we have a service that empowers them to get information about their own case back to them and help them make some decisions. These types of tests and stuff used to be only available at the higher levels of, say, government or law enforcement. You're bringing this now to individuals, to people, to be able to do it. In some cases, yes, but we still do testing for police agencies across the country, throughout North America. We work with lawyers, prosecutors, and defense, uh, but we're also not constrained in that we can offer services right to the public. Fantastic. And what's your involvement with Innovation Guelph? How long has your company been going? What's your connection here? So we're almost nine years old. Uh, we're scaling up right now and we're expanding into taking what we know about DNA, forensic DNA, and applying that to the cannabis market. So we're working with Innovation Guelph right now to market some of our new services for that market. Fantastic. Well, I think that's all today from, <laughs> from this interview. I thought I'd come up with some kind of clever skull closer, but I, I, it didn't really work.